Did you know that the gospel has finally come back to Israel where it all started? For the last 2,000 years, the Besawa, or Good News, has gone from east to west, traveling around the globe, enlightening the non-Jewish world to the Messiah of the Jews. The last stop before Yeshua returns is where it all started. With the great Israeli victory in the 1967 war, the Jewish people had control over Jerusalem for the first time since the Roman occupation. With this, the Jesus movement began. Jews began to awaken as if from a deep slumber, recognizing Yeshua was indeed the Jewish Messiah. It began as a trickle, then a stream, then a river. Today, some estimate there are over 30,000 believers here in Israel, which represents the highest number by far of Jewish believers in the land since the days of Yeshua. As if fitting puzzle pieces together, people in the nations are also waking up to the Jewish roots of their faith. People are learning Hebrew and understanding that the Brit Hadashah, the New Testament, needs to be interpreted within a Jewish context. And amazingly, many believers now realize that they can't really understand what Yeshua or his disciples taught without the Hebrew scriptures, the Old Testament. Because of this phenomenon of the Gentiles returning to their Jewish roots, the Jewish people are being provoked to jealousy or zealousness for the first time in history. And they are taking a second look at the Nazarene from Galilee to see what the fuss is all about. Even some Jewish rabbis are curious about him. We believe many have secretly come to accept him as their Messiah. We do indeed live in very exciting times. Zechariah 8.23 says, Thus says the Lord of hosts, In those days ten men from the nations of every tongue shall take hold of the robe of a Jew, saying, Let us go with you, for we have heard that God is with you.